Yes, my people. Welcome back to another video. I hope you enjoyed the previous one. And what I have lined up for you so today is a reaction video to the Conference South playoff quarter final against St Albans and a football boot giveaway. So, I'm not going to give too much away, and by far, this football match that I played in was the biggest game in my footballing career. Anyway, let's have some fun on this channel, let's start the giveaway, and I'll see you a lot over there. Right, so in front of me, I do have my laptop, I have my camera over there, I have my phone, and this is my setup, by the way. How crazy. I have the wheel of names in front of me, and if you so could see your names, well done for entering this giveaway, and pretty much, just by clicking this, we'll find out who wins. Right here, you can see the requirements for this giveaway. And if you haven't done all these, so if you don't follow me, and if you haven't liked and commented on my recent, etc., etc., you haven't been nominated for this. And just a quick one, by the way, if I type in your YouTube name on my Insta followings and it ain't there, I'm sorry, I'm just gonna have to redo the spin. Anyway, apart from all the jibby jabber, let's get cracking with this spin. Who's gonna be the lucky one? Raman Saman, you are the lucky winner, mate. Let's have a look if you've done all the requirements. Right, and after some VAR, I can confirm Raman Saman, you have commented on my most recent YouTube video by saying them and 50s are class, would love them, and you do follow me on Instagram, so well done, mate. Sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. Um, but yeah, in the future, guys, if you didn't win this giveaway, I'm going to do a massive one when I hit 10k. It'll be about three winners. It'll be even bigger and better. Thank you for all the support so far. Please continue this journey with me, Road to Full Time Ball. And yeah, let's get this reaction video going, and I'll see you all over there. So, let's get these highlights up and let's start this video. Airpods in and let's see how I played. Little setback, game's on the way and I don't know why teams always do this but we do it as well. Thump it long and I mean they've got themselves a throw on up the pitch but yeah. Let's see how I've done. First involvement here, 25 seconds in and there's me just trying to hit it into that area. I mean I under here a little bit but just test them you know, early doors. There's a little switch from Cam, me coming inside, setting Dave back, and then it's just me, just keep it nice and simple, trying to grow myself into the game. Another involvement here, there's me picking up the ball and a massive throw from myself. And you know what, watching it here, my throws are long by the way. And there's Jonesy battling with their centre back, who I think had quite a decent game. But Mike, I balled it. I'm not too sure about that decision though, Riff. Five minutes in, Dave passed me the ball. I didn't really paint the pitch before I got that ball, so first thing I can do is just get out of my feet, try and hit Jonesy, but again. Here's me with another throw one down the line to Jonesy. Jonesy's very good at holding up the ball, by the way. Threw it to his safe side, he holds the ball up, sets myself a whip of first time balling, which weren't too bad, was cleared, only to their player to scuff that. Ty gets the ball down the wing, and that's a corner. From this, Tom takes a decent delivery, keeper parries it, Trot shoots, I thought Car, I thought Cal was going to shoot there but he didn't, keeper makes a decent save then they're able to clear it but what a chance. There's us playing kind of quite a high line, me using my head to actually clear it and right there you know what, I really think this was a decent shot for a penalty you know. Mike got his shirt pulled back proper like, it in the referee's face basically and the referee didn't give it but. Not gonna get everything, okay? And there's me playing a very high line once again, making their wing back play it back and their centre back to just smash it. And Dave to clear up, as per usual. And there's me picking the ball up again, trying to hit it straight over the defenders' heads, but I overcooked that one. There's me picking the ball up again, a baggy touch, but I was able to do a nice little half volley to tie his feet. And then if you can see in the corner, there's me checking in, checking out, but the ball was just slightly over hit from uh, Arj. Here's their first decent chance, and it was a decent save from Ed. I'm not going to lie, they didn't really have a lot of chances this game. Um, me following their wing back inside, I feel like I've done a decent job there. Having his back to goal, and then comes able to clear it. And this chance right here, this is crazy. I don't know what their defender's doing. Trying to keep it on when there's a striker on his back. And again, we just weren't... 
ruthless enough, you know, like it is another decent chance where I feel like on another day we bury them easy because Reese would be scoring a lot of goals. Tom playing me out wide, I hit a nice dive because if you stop it, I knew that the centre back followed Tom into like the midfield. So I thought to myself, he's now out of position. That's why I hit that diag. Ty was able to flick it on. Jones, he gets it down the line. He crosses it in. Tom Justin wasn't able to get it on goal. But from here, Mike does well to win himself a corner. And from this corner again, ugh, and it gets up so high and we miss a decent opportunity. Outswinging from myself. Dave heading that towards goal. But I think Mike was offside. And as you could tell, that was the end of the first half. Again, they just had one half chance. We had a few decent chances, but we didn't capitalise. And let's see what the second half has to offer. Here's a corner for myself. Great area. Keep was punching it like around here, so I feel like that was a decent area. I put that in. Trotz was able to leave it into a dangerous area, but Cam wasn't able to. And it, yeah, there is a little bit of decent defending from myself. Obviously, I was a little bit flat-footed from the start. There's him going shoulder to shoulder with myself. I feel like I've done very well. Maybe I slightly brought him to the ground, but I feel like I used my body extremely well. And yeah, nothing came from that. See, I can defend, you know. Right, two arms up, little back post ball. And it was in a great area again, but I just the lads just got caught up between each other. This is a decent ball for myself. Decent little outswinger. And Dave just wasn't able to get that on goal. I think they're playing slow-mo as well, here, just for you guys. Come on, here we go. I've got so much whip on that as well, but I feel like probably the defender did actually defend quite well there. Straight after that, Dave wins his header. There's me trying to put into that little dangerous area in behind the defenders. I don't think anything came from this, by the way. Oh, might do a few kick-ups, bloody hell. Um, oh, there's me. That was so dead. <laughs> <laughs> Don't know what I was doing there. And then um, Ade's put it back into that area again. Centre back's completely missed that, by the way. Um, oh, yeah, and I've tried to like drive this in there just because by the time I got my head up, players went in the box. So I tried to like waste a little bit of time, wait for them to get in there. Maybe I should have done a little cutback, but it's so like I can improve on. Right, another free kick for myself. That one wasn't floated this time, it was whipped. Um, Kibbe came out and claimed that. Here's me getting the ball again, leaving it into a decent area to have to run onto. Um, next one here, yeah, a little flick from that right wing back. Again, nice little high pressure on myself. And there's me doing a long throw on inside. No one was able to get there, but again, there's like another little chance that only if he might have slipped in Jonesy there. Wow, I didn't even see that, you know, but what a chance. Here's me cutting the pass. My legs are so heavy by now. Little mistake for myself, and they nearly capitalised on that mistake. That's poor from me. Another chance here. Honestly, we were just going all out right now. Little cross ball back posts weren't too bad. Is me out swinging corner. Nice little drive corner for myself. Dave down into the ground and kick made a decent save there. There's me over 50-50 and I went bottling out that second one so I just literally swung a leg in and luckily it landed to Dave's feet. And yeah, no, that is the final bit of action for the full time and now we actually do go into extra time. No second legs here. This is like trench work right here. <laughs> Alright, you know what they're going to do. Thump it long. And let's deal with that. A little throw in from myself into Simeon. And there's me always trying to like join into play whenever I can. Punch it inside. Because you know what? I don't always want to like hook it down the line. That ain't me. Um, and Ty does well to go on his right foot, swings it in, and Tom just wasn't able to get an end of his first touch. Sets it back to Arge. Arge into Trotz. Trotz back out to Arge. And this is just the start to the heartbreak. I don't think I want to speak about this uh, counter attack, but um, yeah, some things don't need commentary. And here, oh, you know what? This is what really triggered me. So after putting in that ball and we did score, I thought to myself, 
this just ain't our day, lads. Oh, I was so upset after putting that ball in and no one got on the end of it because this is actually a really strange fact here. I ain't got an assist for Chelmsford. I've played about 16 games for them this season. I've got one goal. Not very good stats, but I promise next season they'll be better. Right, straight from that, I've won myself a header. Played it into Arge. Arge back into Trotz. Trotz to Arge. Arge gets in it. Next highlight, um, there's Ty playing it back to me, a nice little whipped ball down the line. Great error for myself and they clear it. Beachy playing it to me, me little dink pass into um, Fred's feet which is a nice little ball. And that was it for the first half of extra time. Nice little outswing from myself, always picking up Dave. And again, that was just so close, like another one. Me outswinger again to Dave, keeper makes a save. It's just like a broken record at the moment. Like we have so many chances and they're, they're just not going in. And is them showing their time wasting skills. Me battling with their centre mid. I've done a right there to obviously put them off balance and then tackle their striker. Little cheeky dive when I saw the free kick. Pretty much from that free kick, Eddie's hit a pretty much of a not his best kick, and now they're left 1v1. And, right, I don't want to take any claim, well, I do basically, but it isn't the time to do it, but right here, I took the most slightest touch, which actually helped Beachy flick it around the post. Helped Beachy make that save, so. Um, another long throw one for myself, we're getting really desperate now, and I don't have a clue how the, how the referee, sorry, has over, overruled his decision and gave a bloody goal kick. You can see it come off the other centre-back's leg for a corner. He just gave a goal kick. And after that, there was the full-time whistle after extra time to the Ormans 1-1-0. Um, I feel like it was the most 0-0 game or 1-0 game to us especially. But unfortunately, these lot just had that extra bit of quality where they've got that 1-0 win and it just wasn't meant to be and I'm sure us lads will be raring to go next season, even though the likes of Yeovil and Torquay will be in our league. I'm sure we can make the Chelsea Stadium a fortress and yeah, get some vital wins under our belt and get to that National League because, as you well and truly know, I signed a contract. I'm committed to this club for next season and yeah, let's see where it takes us. But as you all well and truly know, this is road to full time ball. So Hopefully I'll be able to do it with Chelsea today. Right, but apart from that, I hope you've enjoyed this video in particular. Um, little shout out to the National League TV and Chelsea for letting me use their footage. And yeah, make sure you like, comment and subscribe. I shall see you soon, yeah. Take care and bow.